The race to the ninth Agus Pulse is accelerating with nine days left to the D-Day. Azimio flag bearer Raila Odinga and his running mate Martha Karua settling for Suswa grounds in Narok to sell their agenda. Ndugu yangu Raila Odinga akichukua usukani maji kutoka kijabe kuja Suswa mpaka nduka moja itakuwa tayari. Ukiniona ona madhe yako. Na mahali madhe ako kijana yote atakumbukwa shida zenu tutabeba tarehe tisa alfajiri vijana mnaamka mnapiga firimbi kumsha watu warauke waende wapige In what would be dubbed as the fifth Suswa declaration, the Maasai elders endorsed Odinga and Karua for the house on the hill while rallying the community behind the Azimio leadership. Kenyan will be safe in the hands of Raila Amolo Odinga. The Ma community have traditionally used the historic grounds to make major declaration and this time Odinga choosing to return to the grounds for a final pitch at his candidature to the Ma community. Sasa nakuja hapa kuwadanganya nikichukua serikali ndaweka nda fence. Fence gani? Fence gani? But the DP would face the wrath of the Azimio leaders following his tirade in Kapsabet on Friday. They want the DP to seize on his threats against the president. Mambo ambayo ameongea jana ameongea huko Kapsabet. Bona kuongea akiwa Nairobi. Bona kuongea akiwa Muranga. Bona kuongea hapa Narok. 207 huyo jamaa alikuwa anashikilia koti ya baba. Sivyo, alikuwa project 2013, 2017, baba ni project ya wa Kenya. Alikufanyia heshima ya juu sana, ili wewe mfanye kazi na ee. Lakini baada ya kufenda kufanya kazi, ulienda kutanga tanga. Mambo ya fitisho, na uliza William Samuel Ruto na watu yake. Wawache, kama ee huwa napanga mipango ya vifo, ya watu wengine na watoto ya watu wengine. Uhuru hawezi kupanga sasa kwa ajili uhuru anaondoka anaenda nje. Azimio is claiming that the DP has sensed the defeat and as such has resulted to threats as a way of consoling himself. Wiper leader Kalonzo Musyoka also took the deputy president William Ruto head on asking the DP to keep his name out of his mouth and instead focus on selling his agenda. Jana alirongea kwa hasira sana upande wa Kapsabet. Karibu anafanya incitement akimwambia rais ambaye ni boss wake uhuru kenyata anamwambia leave me alone the coalition is further noting that the dp tyrants will not call them from achieving their winning resolution on the 9th august should they form the next government odinga is promising the ma community that water issues a livestock abattoir land issues and the continuation of restoration of Mao forest cover will remain top priority in the region. On her part, running Met Martha Karua argued that after traversing through the country, Kenyans have chosen to solidly rally behind them since their agenda is about unity. Angalia hao wengine. Ndoto zao ni kunyakuwa na wizi peke yake. Mimi na waomba zote tusirudi nyuma na tueneze hii mambo ya kwamba rais wa Kenya ndiyo twende mbele ni Raila Amolo Odinga. With only seven days remaining before the official campaign period to come to a conclusion, the Asimio team is insisting that the solution to Kenya's problem lies with them. Tomorrow, the campaigns are expected in Wasin Gishu and Nandi counties. Martin Opio, KTV, Suswa Grounds, Narok County.